my first goal is that YSU becomes the, not an, the anchor university in Northeast Ohio. Youngstown State's president gives his first State of the University address and focuses on growing enrollment. Bill Johnson has been on the job as president of Youngstown State for eight months. He told faculty and staff this morning the university is attracting more students but needs to do even more. He believes sharing the YSU success stories can boost enrollment and, of course, raise revenues because of that. First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti shares more from the president's address. YSU's Bill Johnson held his very first State of the University address, telling faculty and staff Youngstown State is in what he calls a good place. We're very financially sound. Enrollment is up. Johnson says he's not looking to cut any programming in his first year. In fact, he's planning to begin offering 60 new courses online this fall to meet the needs of students from Eastern Gateway Community College and has his eyes on one day holding classes in Steubenville. And soon the big red Y will be going up in Steubenville in Jefferson County as we begin teaching in the classroom there as well. But Johnson says the university needs to do more to attract students from around the region and not risk losing them to other schools, something he claims will boost both enrollment and tuition revenues. We've got to do student hunting where the students are, and we need to use tools and methods that will actually resonate with them. In other words, we must be competitive. Johnson told the audience a third of YSU's revenues come from state and federal sources, but he adds the university has been missing out on obtaining more of those funds in the past. We need to have a seat at the table when the debate is going on, when decisions are being made, not standing at the back of the line, only to be told after the fact that we didn't get what we needed. Johnson admits the university will have its challenges, but told the audience it can overcome some of those by communicating and marketing the programs and opportunities YSU has to offer. Jerry Ricciuti, WKVN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.